Today, church celebrates the solemnity of the Most Holy Trinity, and we are invited to become sons and daughters of the Trinity by participating in the love and unity of the Trinity. Very often human tendency is to know God and the nature of God. Calling back to Deuteronomy chapter 4, there is no God for lake, there is no God for river, but there is only one God. That is the great contribution that Abraham made in the Old Testament. Coming to the New Testament, we have a clear vision that God is three persons. Towards the end of Matthew's Gospel, where we see, Go and make disciples by baptizing them in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. Here we see the clear vision of the Trinity. Three persons, but one God. And we have been invited to participate in the love of the Trinity and the life of the Trinity. There is something beautiful that Paul brings out in his letter to Romans chapter 4 verses 14. All are born by the Spirit of God are sons of God and we all are sons of God and we are his we have we are proud to call Abba Father. We are no more belong to the spirit of slavery and today let us be free and be aware that we all belong to the trinity and we participate in the redemptive love of god redemptive love of the trinity may almighty god bless us all amen